Um, so I believe as well, like I'm in agreement that this is uh, most likely the result of colonization. And to further to further explain that, it's the fact of the matter that because uh, a lot of the countries were subjugated, it was a, becoming a deliberate and gradual process of where they were, where the colonizers were implementing their own methodologies and instilling this idea of like, we're the ones who conquered you, we're the ones who are governing you, and we did it through this way. So, so ergo, we must be superior. And eventually that would seep into someone's mind because, you know, when you're, when you're going through a tough time, it's if you don't have like the strong, a strong enough heart, it can be pretty easy to let what others say get to you. And if it's done persistently over the course of not just years, but decades, centuries, it can, it becomes internalized. Absolutely. And that's what I feel like is become the, has become uh, the result. And if what I've seen in not just Desi countries, but a lot of African countries as well, East Asian, Southeast Asian, and, it w- it's just become this idea of where they lost the concept of God in their heads. And as a result, they only think about the material world and they think of what is considered success in the material world. And this it, it's become the idea of what liberalism and colonization and uh, f- implementation of another system, removing the concept of spirituality it's yeah. become this idea of like the only success you're going to have in this world is the success you have in the material world, you know, and it's a, a further extension of the concept of like YOLO. You only live once. you only got this one life. So what are you going to do with it? Have fun, have be successful, have the money, have the power, enjoy it. And it's become the part. And as a result, we've lost sight of preparing for the akhira, preparing for the afterlife. So I feel like that's what's been going on, but um, I would have to say coming from a Latino background, I don't really, it's kind of like 50, 50, like the stereotype for Desi's is like, that's all their minds are set towards like having the profession, but, so, but half, but it's kind of like 50, 50 within Latino and also black societies where it's like, we want to have better lives, but at the same time, we're very, um, we're very community oriented. We're very collectivist in nature. And as a result, and the way we go about it is that you also have to be doing something that's going to contribute to the community. And sometimes because of that, we sometimes feel like if someone goes beyond, if they become a doctor and an engineer, yeah, that's great. Would be, would be, but if they're not contributing to the community, Mm -hmm. becoming a doctor or a lawyer or an engineer can actually be something looked down upon in my community because we have this negative aspect of like the second you get a better, you better get a better sense of life. You're going to abandon where you come where you come from you're going to be you're going to colonize yourself you're going to lose sight of your heritage Mm -hmm. so we're not at so we're not as easily uh, accustomed to assimilation as we've as and i don't i don't mean this as an insult but sometimes i feel it seems like the eastern world is more accustomed to assimilating than latino and black societies here in america Mm -hmm. mm-hmm mm-hmm Okay. Yeah. Makes sense. Makes sense. So that's why I see that the older generations and a few of those generations, you know, not only just one generation, like for the past hundreds of years, I see that the trend uh, of people were more willing to let go of their theme um, and move towards dunya because they and this is what I believe is we, um, because of losing that touch, we became so dunya oriented that we were looking only for the benefits of this dunya. We lost the sight of akhira. We lost the sight of pleasing Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. We lost the, uh, you know, the taste in waiting patiently to be rewarded, we, we lost that. I mean, we want immediate gratification, immediate results right away. You know, I did something good. I need to feel good now. I did something good. I need to see people acknowledging that. And if not, I'm discouraged. And that is a very, um, I think it's a very weak place to be because that kind of directs your life, the whole life, 
because you would do or do not do things based on how what kind of reaction you're getting from people or, or those around you.